You know, this this whole Gamescom thing is your fault. You know that, right? <laughs> Thank you. Because I wouldn't be able to play anything. A bunch of Fortnite fans would just be in here the whole time like, why aren't you restreaming uh, what Gamescom? Volume up? I ain't trying to listen to what this guy has to say. This shit is Avengers sleeping face, bro. Gears of War? Hold on. Let me get my Xbox. This is just going to end up being us talking shit the whole time, right? I'm looking into the official chat, Gamescom. And I'm seeing nothing but sleeping faces over there like crazy. You would think that we are a nice guy chat compared to those toxic sleeping motherfuckers over there. Need for speed heat? How you doing? Hey, good. Glad good to be here. All right, so need for speed Look, that's heat. fucked up. The Look at these. Look, did you see the audience? There are people who have front row seats who have to turn around to look at these guys. Did you notice that? They got to break their necks. Look at that shit. The front row is way in front of the people who are talking. You got to break your neck. You don't want front row at Gamescom. You want, like, fucking nosebleeds. European engineering at its finest. Look at the guys in the front row breaking their necks. <laughs> That's fucked up, dude. Thank you. That's fucked up. Front row's trash, dude. Why don't you turn your chair? <laughs> Jesus, man. Who designed that stage? What is this? Is this Little Nightmares 2 or some shit? I think it's Little Nightmares 2. I flushed that game hard and I felt pretty bad about it too because... <laughs> yeah, Thank you. it is. Damn, that's fucked up. I tried that game and moved the character around for three seconds and then flushed that game in the trash. And I was like... You know, I didn't even give it a chance because I didn't even want to give it a chance. I don't know what happened, how that went down, but I didn't like it. It was slow. I, I thought it was going to be like a platformer, but it was a slow platformer. Little Nightmares 2. Yes. Hey, how you doing? So far, Gamescom has been mad hype. The next episode of Life is Strange 2, episode 4, is uh, coming out this week, and we've got the first look at the trailer. Check Ooh, it man, out. Life is Strange? Yeah, it's just getting rough. It's just getting real ugly. Maybe I should drink some alcohol. Get me through this. Is this Life is Strange? I've never played Life is Strange, but it seems like playing an episode of the TV show Blossom. What do I do now? I did like that game, uh... Detroit Become Human, but that game had a lot of, like, themes and concepts that I like. Hating robots, uh, being a hostage negotiator, uh, you know, stuff like that. I hate robots. I got no money, but I gotta pay for this free content. <laughs> hey, get Perry. You guys tell me when to get hype, alright? I don't even know anymore. <laughs> Thank you. Is that a caveman? Is this a Geico commercial? Geico Battle Royale? Oh Thank shit. You. Is this even a game? CD Project Red? Wow, that looks shitty. Is this. Wow, dude. I'm surprised that they're willing to put this shit on a trailer. <laughs> Thank you. I would play this game for Thank a Hellcat, you. for sure. Breathtaking landscapes. Kind folk. Welcoming of travelers. I wake you'd have a much better time there. And Novigrad. That's another beast, I tell you. Yeah, I know, it's on Switch. They're showing the Switch version. It looks pretty awful. All right, there you go. Witcher 3 Switch announced October 15th. That's the announcement of the release date for that. Uh, now <laughs> we're going to talk about FIFA 20. This is like a hating stream. 
right? Is that how everyone's chat is? Like other other pro Twitch actors who are restreaming this? Is that what they're all doing, or is there a place where people are excited? There must be some place on Earth that's excited about this. No one. Hmm. Oh, see, from the creators of Halo. That's that's a uh, the original Doom before they turned it all red and dumb. Uh, for what? Maybe it's F Zero. <laughs> Thank you. You think it's F Zero? They gotta start playing Mute City. Oh. Damn, dude. That sucks. What is this? I feel like every... This reminds me of, like, Anthem, and it also reminds me of that other game that they made a second one of that sucked. Uh, what was that game called? Titanfall. Uh, everyone always talked about how great Titanfall 1 was, but nobody played it. And then Part 2 came out and everyone said it's so good. But even the people that said it was good didn't play it. The grab cycle? I'm a pilot. Uh-huh. It's called the pre-flight inspection. No judgment here, Titanfall. All these people in the chat room who are like, I love Titanfall, but you didn't play it. What was that? I didn't see the name. Was it Gears of War? I love this. Hey, thanks, Jay. Wow. What a streak of shitty games. It's, uh, it's unbelievable that there could be this many in a row that I personally at least don't give a fuck about. It's shocking. I have a pretty broad taste in games. I play a lot of different types of games. Things are going well. You guys are very None of these yeah, have looked cool at all. Uh, so here we go. The good stuff. This is where it starts. Thriller. I love that album. Sergeant Blake. It's extremely likely whoever killed your father killed Mr. Joe. <laughs> Thank you. Whoa. Anything I can do to help? This is like that dating game. Bam. Excuse me. Someone in the chat room was like, those graphics are amazing. Yeah. I need to find out what it is. They're not graphics, right? This is like VHS. It's a real person. Those aren't graphics. There's an intruder at Delphi House. I'm going. I think I'm gonna play this game. This might be one of those games where I could really direct. <laughs> Eris Shyamalan. Thank you. I'm going to play this game. Hey, write this one down. My God, what have you done? <laughs> write it down in pencil, though. Thank you. No ink. Out now? For the players. Really? There you go with the shadow drop. I'm here with uh, Jack from Flavorworks and Holly, the star of Erica. Great to have you here at Gamescom. Hi, Welcome. Nice to be here. Uh, so this is a cool surprise with Erica. We hadn't seen for a while, and then <laughs> Thank uh, you. was wondering what's going on. And here it is with the trailer and out tonight. Um, so first of all, let me kick off with you, Holly. Tell us a bit about Erica, the character that you play. Um, so Erica <laughs> is a little bit Thank of an enigma. Um, she's a girl who's had this incredibly traumatic childhood experience and it's haunted her her whole life. 
and it's shrouded in mystery. And so when you meet her and you join her, on damn, her both day, chat rooms are loving her. Who she can trust both chat rooms, the same room. time, perverts. They're probably the same guys. Live action, and they can download people are getting today. banned in the other yeah, chat like crazy. People are getting banned hard in the other chat like crazy. They're all talking about face sitting and shit. You know, they deserve it. Thank you so much for coming all the way to Cologne. Thank you. Hey, thanks for keeping it classy, guys. I know that you are the same people in that chat that are getting banned. So I appreciate that you keep the scummy shit over there. Is this Kojima? It is. <laughs> Thank you. VHS footage. <laughs> Thank you. I brought an early gift. Please enjoy. The one and only Hideo Kojima. This guy literally was walking around E3 with a halo of people surrounding him, like he was Michael Jackson. You're such a genius. I was 10 feet away from him before I got toppled over by his fucking secret security service. I'm not even making this shit up. This is 100% true. Anakin was there and uh, Jackie Tran. We all got knocked over. Out of the way. Top player coming through. Gamescom. Strand on your feet. He's here, Strand? The one and only, Hideo Kojima. Oh, I get it. Oh, they're playing that song. It's uh, Apocalyptica. I think it's called Path. Mr. Kojima, it is such an honor to have you with us. I know how hard you've been working to finish up this. I return after five years to visit Gamescom again. <laughs> it's great to have you back, and everyone's going crazy. Look at the selfies happening here live. <laughs> Damn, the crowd can't be contained. You see what I mean? Security! <laughs> Thank you. Death Stranding is in the final, really crunch time of development stage, and I shouldn't actually be here, but I really wanted to meet you all, so I came to Germany. Mr. Kojima, always here for his fans for us, which is so amazing. Uh, so, Mr. Kojima, we know that you're, as you said, just about finishing up the game, and everyone's very curious, the whole world is curious, what you can tell us about this game, um, and what you want to share tonight with all of us. So, hey, can you what are you looking at, you want to Harold? <laughs> Good luck proving what I'm laughing at, bitch. It's a new game, it's an open world game, and it's a very, very new, and I hope that everyone will like it. So, uh, since it was quite popular to show a new character at Comic Con, today I would like to uh, introduce uh, more new characters today. Double today. Uh, well, let's look at the first one. Okay, let's take a look at the first character for Mr. Kojima. Shh. It's maximum <laughs> volume. Thank you.
<laughs> Thank you. Oh, thank you. What is she? She's my daughter. And I'm the mama. It's okay. She's only connected to me. Not like the other two teachers. You can see it, right? They're hooked up. <laughs> thank you. Now you know why. Yeah, all right. That was kind of the introduction. Hey, uh, what are you looking of, at? Uh, Do you Mama, like it? Uh, played by Miss uh, Quali uh, Margaret Qualley. あのデストランディングにはすごくユニークなキャラがいっぱい登場して、メインストリー、メインストリーの他に各キャラクターの伏線がいっぱい絡み合ってできあがってるお話です。so there are a lot of characters appear in Death Stranding and each uh, unique character has like a sub story from um, apart from the main story. I can smile and laugh if I want to. So, Fuck you. Uh, Mama's setting is that her baby was born unfortunately on the other side and not in her world. So, uh, but however, they are still connected by the umbilical cord, so that's why she can't, um, uh, that's how they kind of exist. <laughs> so she's a, she has a sad background where she can't move because her baby is actually on the other side and she's on the, uh, the real world and they're still connected, that's why she can't move from that location. Hi. Thanks. I have another one to see. Uh, another you. one? Okay, let's check it out. We got a lot of stuff hey, for you. Thanks. Hey. This is this is cool. <laughs> this is Hideo Kojima's he's been holding this turd in for years. Shh. Dead man, you there? Little help. Okay, sir. Remove the body connected to that incubator. Mierda. It's already turned all the way up. It doesn't get any louder. Fuck you. <laughs> right now the pod is synchronizing with the steel mother in capital not city and reconfiguring its settings based on the latest data returning your bb to the womb in this manner will temporarily reduce its stress level that being where it technically belongs of course kid looks happy uh, you should remember that BBs are just equipment. <laughs> Try not to get attached. Each one has been physically removed from its steel mother's womb. A process that renders them unpredictable 
<laughs> Thank you. No BB on record has remained in service for over a year. Uh, it may need to be retired before this expedition is over. And then, you saying there's no way to keep my BB alive? Uh, you must understand, there is still a great deal we don't know about BBs. As we expand the chiral network and recover more past data, perhaps we'll find our answers. Yeah, all right. That was an introduction of uh, Dead Man played by Guillermo uh, del Toro, and also introduction of BB. Yeah, he does interrupt a lot, huh? You saw the video explaining what BB was about, and you saw that Sam always had this uh, baby in his pod, uh, and wondering what it was about. So that gives a great explanation of it. <laughs> so it's a, again another kind of a sad uh, story that Sam has with the BB because the BB is connected to the world of the dead and that allows the connection between BB and Sam so that the Sam could see the BTs. So you, will, so you will kind of um, have this journey with the baby together and you will have uh, attachment and, and more connection and that will be the part of the gameplay. Wow. Well, it's uh, pretty amazing to see the wow. level that you're thinking of, of the two worlds, everything coming together. Um, it's, it's amazing. Uh, well, Mr. Kojima, uh, I think everyone here is excited to see characters, but... I don't know about you, but wouldn't you want to see some gameplay of Death Stranding? Hey, all right. Game of play. Um, I'm kind of thinking of showing the gameplay at Tokyo Game Show. Uh, Jeff, since it's, uh, it's Jeff's show and everyone's so excited, I would like to show you just a, a little bit of it. Interrupted. It'll be, it'll be kind of a hint to you as well. This guy cuts people off all day. And uh, of course, there'll be a little gameplay that I would like to show you next, but there'll be a kind of a star that will come out. Make sure you catch that star that appears. A what? Let's look at it together. All right, here we go. The first gameplay, Death Stranding. Yo! I can't... Shh. Thanks. Just a little longer. <laughs> Thank you. Gameplay, huh? Here we go. That's a big backpack. What? Gameplay, huh? <laughs> Perverb. <laughs> Thank you. Whoa! He grew a mushroom! Shit's gonna get psychedelic. Over here! I'm Sam! Shh. Hey!
Anybody hear me? I wish they had that in Zelda. Stupid climbing. He's just gonna leave it? Treasure. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat> hey, when's this shit come out? Delivering cargo. PS five. Hey, is that the guy that's running the game awards? Man, these guys love each other's nuts. <laughs> Weird. Yeah, I'm in the game. <laughs> Weak. I'm pretty excited about the game, but. It's pretty weird how everyone is like so into Code Gamer. We asked Jeff to appear in our game as a cameo. Thank you. It was honored to be asked to be in the game. Matthew Mercer actually does the voice of the character that I play in the game, and I know there are a bunch of cameos in the game as well from from friends of yours. Tell me a bit about weird ass cameo. They should have put Thanos. I know. You know, it's a new style of game. And you've talked about, you know, the strand genre. And I think it's very important for people <laughs> Thank to see. You. There are a lot of hints there about the type of game that you're going to play. 
分断された町と町、人と人をつないでいきます。I can't really say so much, but you're, you're going to play as Sam and、um, you're going to have to connect the fractured、uh, cities and people from east to west, and you have to connect. And there are、uh, some obstacles in the way, like BTs or terrorists, to avoid that. And there are, along the way, you'll find people like living alone, like you saw Jeff.、Uh, we call it preppers. There are actually kind of hiding, so some preppers、uh, don't really have to do with the main storyline. <laughs> so, you might want to find、uh, these preppers along the way, and if you kind of get connected with them, you might have some things that they provide you. So, So, I can't really reveal too much, but when you start to connect like this in the game with preppers and others, you'll notice that <laughs> you're kind of、uh, connected to the people worldwide. So, in, in the video with Mr. Del Toro,、uh, he explained about the baby sometimes g e t s self poisoned.、Uh, you saw in the gameplay as well when you kind of felt、uh, the baby is stressed. So, what you do is you use the PlayStation 4's motion controller,、uh, sensitive controller, and you kind of like.、Uh, uh, but if you shake too, too fast, the baby will get angry. So, make sure you kind of handle with care. Um, about the urine part, I have to say. It's,、uh, it's late enough to kind of discuss about that, right? So if you're like, try to be, try to move the camera and try to see what he's doing, Sam will move away so you'll never see actually what he's doing. Except on PC. But, and also, there is an option where you cannot、uh, release yourself like that. Like, in, like if people are near you. So don't worry, Norman fans. You won't have <laughs> Thank to be, you. You, know,、um, uh, you don't have to worry about that. <laughs> Although I heard,、uh, is it true that that also can be a weapon, though, in the game? So,、uh, yes, it could be used as a weapon, but also it, it could kind of.、Um, key. Key, key. It, it will be a kind of one of the key,、uh, and you'll find out later. You saw the mushroom growing, so if everyone kind of does it at the same spot, it will, you will have. Something good later on. <laughs> well, of course, that's not the main part of the game, okay? <laughs> the main part is to connect the world together. <laughs> well, I gotta say, it's so amazing、um, to. You know, pissing game. Mind, I wonder if they're shitting. I think everyone's trying to piece together how they're shitting. That'll be sweet.、Together. Um, but it's amazing stuff. Now, I know we have some photos. Primary and secondary weapon. Ago, I already know my build. Tell me what we were doing, but you're like, come down to San Diego. What the hell? Sit here, they put dots on my face. They did the full scan. <laughs> the same day that Nicholas Wooden Refn did his scan as well.、Uh, this was like, I think, September, October, two years ago. And I'm working what out. Do you're like, trust me. Down. I'm like, okay, sure. And then I find out I'm Patreon ho. Scan,、right? Thanks,、uh, Bomba Frank. So, if you find him in the game and if you go to him、um, and、um, make the connection with him, he might give you something good.、Uh, Jeff is actually kind of apparent and you could find him easily. So, when the game comes out, just look for Jeff. <laughs> Well, I'm honored to have a little role with a cameo, and there'll be some other cameos, I'm sure, as well in this game. So, this is not a good thing. 
Yes, I can't really say who <laughs> thank yet, you. but there are many people in cameos. <laughs> Mr. Kojima, uh, thank you so much for coming all this way to share a little bit more of Death Stranding with us. What do you guys think? Go Pretty insane, insane, right? I think the game looks cool, and I'm so excited about it. I don't care what you haters say. I can't to wait to right? piss and shit all over mushrooms and then eat them. All right, Mr. Kojima, it's going to be so sweet. Yes, that's right. And Mr. Kojima will also be doing a signing session here at Gamescom, right? And that'll be... Uh, uh, one more thing, sorry. Uh, at the Sony booth, you, you'll see more about like the briefing, the reason why Sam has to do this, the briefing scenes, uh, you'll see at the Sony booth from tomorrow, so if you have time, just stop by. Excuse me. And if you see that, you'll understand what you saw today with uh, trying to find Jeff and things like that, so it will be... Uh, you'll, you'll get to be revealed more, and you'll be understanding what we saw today. Damn, we will be revealed? Right, so a briefing scene at the Sweet. Sony booth. Mr. Kojima will also be doing a signing, and I can't tell you how much we all appreciate you coming all the way from Tokyo just as you're finishing the game to be here for me, to be here for the fans. Uh, give it up, Mr. Kojima. He's just finishing the game. Dale Kojima, thank you so much. All right. Friend. It's always such a pleasure. Aki, thank you so much. Dale Kojima. All right, guys. Well, Let's say the name again. That's going to do it the for day our of... first ever Gamescom opening night live. Uh, that's it? Let's have fun. Should we do this every year? All right. Well, I got to say, it's been a ton of fun putting this together. It's been great to be here in Europe. I no want to thank all the developers. I want to no? thank okay. Game and Cole Messi for giving us the opportunity. To yeah, that would be crazy because that was basically just a bunch of garbage and then... Hideo uh, Kojima. We will see you guys, of course, this December, the Game Awards will be back for our fifth anniversary live in Los Angeles. Much more information coming soon. We've got some pretty cool stuff to show you guys and some big new announcements, so stay tuned for that. But uh, enjoy Gamescom, guys. Thank you so much. I'm Jeff Keeley. Have a great Gamescom, and we'll see you in December at the Game Awards. Good night. They're gonna start like a Nintendo conference or some shit, right? Or not? You gotta be patient. It's about to start. Hmm. Weird, I didn't think <laughs> it was so you. short. I thought it was more of like an all-day type of a thing. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you. What did we take away from that? The only thing I need Thank to worry you. about is that one game, Erica, right? What is that on? POS 4? I'm not going to just download it and play it right now. I gotta look into it. What if it sucks? <laughs> Thank you. I gotta look into it. Decide if I wanna play it. Mm. There are zero reviews. Yeah, I know. That's why. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna be the one to review it. Hell no. I already made that mistake with crying is not enough. It was the best mistake I've ever made in my life. 